Hey everyone, Erin here, your hostess with the mostess, and welcome back to quite possibly the very last episode of Undertale. Um, I'm here playing, as always, my co-host, John. John, go ahead and say something. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm also joining you for this uh, final thing. And hello. Oh, yes. Hello. Whew. Okay. Alright, so we went back to get some bicycles. Like, a lot of them. So now John's a motherfucking tank. And I think we'll be able to take this. Also, I looked at it, and apparently you can't actually spare him on your first playthrough, so you have to kill him. Well, that sucks. Yeah. Yeah, it does. And shit. All right, time to focus. Focusing, hopefully, nope. I hate that. Huh. Fuck. It's like... I don't know. This is not going so well. Well, for health, for health, you're doing pretty good. You should probably, like, hang out on one of the sides. Yeah, I was, I was just thinking that. It's not even half health yet. Oh. 
Oh, this is a tough one. Oh! For fuck's sake. I'm so dead. Are you kidding me? I don't know how I survived that. Yeah, I don't know either. Sort of making this work. Not really. It's not really going very well. Shit. Oh, I hate those. Don't lose your cool. Oh. That one is really starting to become another one I hate. This one I've been better at, but then I just screwed up. Fuck. I need more health. So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. It is Toriel. Yeah. Wow. She already was a mother. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. 
I just wanted everyone to have hope. But... I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. I can pick Mercy. <laughs> well, <laughs> alright, of course I'm gonna do Mercy. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer. Well, <laughs> with all my friends. Then live happily on the surface. Alright, well, here's the thing. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't know what John's life was like on the surface, but we met so many cool friends down here, and there's lots of interesting places and things. Like, um, I... I don't know if the surface is really all that great that you're talking about. I really wanted to go in more detail, but I guess right now my brain isn't working very well, so... Uh, it sucks. Yeah. But you tried. Oh, thank you. Human. I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. I know what this thing you idiot you haven't learned a thing in this world it's go or break old oh my god he stole their souls what the fuck is this? What? What happened? One day they all disappeared without a trace? Flowey. Level 9999. My world. Jesus. Should I restart? I think you have to continue. Yeah, I mean... Fuck. If, oh boy. Asgore was tough enough. This... This doesn't... Bode well. No, no it doesn't. Oh! Okay. Alright, just just do it. What is going on? Um where where can I go? Can I go anywhere? What? Did I touch something? Oh. Oh, File. Oh, J Jesus Christ. Howdy! Who 
it's me, Flowey. Flowey the flower. Oh, you are huge legs. You really do not know that old fool. Without you, I never could have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And now I've got the human souls. Alright, please stop doing that. Well, I'm just trying to, like, do his voice, but he's giant now. Like, how is he supposed to sound? Alright, you, you can keep doing it. It's just really... Whatever. Boy, I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wriggling. Alright, that's just gross. Oh, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more. Before I become God. Alright, I hope that he doesn't talk anymore, because please stop doing that. Oh no, I think it's kind of funny. I'm then with my newfound powers. The monsters. Humans. Everyone. I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. <coughs> Alright, never mind, you win. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'll just, I'll just do something else. I'll do the normal one he does. Alright, then that that's better, I guess. Oh, and... Forget about escaping to your old save file. It's gone forever. The town where he, your old friend Flowey, has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over and over. How can that be a... Oh, is something happening? What? Do you really think you can stop me? Hehehe. <laughs> you really are an idiot. Um. Uh, what? It's... This is like the first 3D model I've seen. Or is it? It's not pixel art. Definitely not. God, that's terrifying looking. Ugh. Oh, wow. Um. So. Um, is this something I can even survive? Um, I am dead. I am, like, already dead. What's warning? Warning.
I don't know, I'm just... What? That has so much help! How am I going to do this? I can't dodge anything. Does the fire hurt me too? Oh god. Those realistic eyeballs are... Well, I don't think you're really in danger, though. Really? You think that? Just a bad dream. And you never again. Wow. Um, is that just the end? Because we can't do anything. We don't have any people to help us. There's no, like, super anime friendship conquers all going on. Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied killing you only one time? <laughs> is, is this really... Oh, excuse me. 